G'day gang, Danny, how's it going folks? We're back in the World of Warcraft. Classic, hardcore, on the Undead Rogue. Let's have a look here at our map. So we're gonna go hand that in. Uh, we've got... Got some Vile fin scale to get, I don't really want to go out to those Murlocs. Got some Notched Ribs to gather. Uh, proof of Demise, Scarlet in Signia ring, some zealots and things to take out. I can get the rings over here as well. Uh, but we don't have to go that far. I guess we could go for this one first. And then maybe this one. But first, let's go hand in this quest. Because we might... Well, we're not going to level up, but we're going to get a little bit of XP. We're level 8 at the moment. And still alive. <laughs> still kicking. Still kicking. Let's have a look at the death statistics out there. Rogue average death level 13.9. Paladin is far higher, 20. Well, on the rogue, we need to get we need to get beyond 13. The goal is to get to at least at least 15, I'd say. Obviously, I want to get to 60. That's the goal. That's a top end goal, but. If I can get to 15, I won't be what now? I won't be too ticked off. What is it? Magistrate Severin wants a report. Very well. The defenders at the bulwark are holding the majority of the scourge at bay, but some do slip through on occasion. We have seen sporadic scourge activity east of this station, with a concentration around the Balnir farmstead. Okay, back we go. So that's... Take that report back to the Magistrate. See what they got to say. Uh, for those of you that have been joining me on twitch.tv slash Azeroth Dan, uh, lately I've been playing a lot of hardcore. I, I think I've mentioned this in a previous episode. But um, yeah, it's been good to see you all come through. It's, it's certainly something which I didn't expect to find so much enjoyment out of it. I really am streaming there quite a bit because it's like, I like playing it every night just about. Just about every night. I do have some Dragonflight series uh, episodes coming though soon. Uh, now that the full raid is available in LFR, you'll probably find the first wing covered. And maybe even the second wing over the next couple days. Uh, we got a lot of quests to do, but I wanted to get through the raid first before I continued. Because that's where the last quest I had was pointing to it is troubling to hear the skirt right one two three four and a bit four and a half bars away from level eight still not quite high enough to get dual wielding but we'll get there so i'm thinking thinking i go here first this could prove to be a costly mistake but I'm going to do it anyway. Need some earth root so I can make another strength potion. Keep an eye out for that. So on stream, so far I've had... I've had a rogue, I've had a warrior, I had another warrior, and uh, currently on a paladin. Highest low I've had so far is 22. And the paladin is at 17 at the moment. So he's catching up. He's getting there. And if he dies... I think the next, uh, the next class I do, or try, will be a shaman, orc shaman. Uh, but I don't know whether I'll, I mean, on, on stream I'll probably just keep going, but, I mean, if this guy dies, I haven't quite thought about that. I don't want him to die. <laughs> don't die, okay? Just don't die. 
But I gotta be careful, I find that at the, the first 10 minutes of every stream is where I'm most vulnerable. It's because I haven't quite got my my thinking to that frame, the right frame and state of mind. I'm not looking closely at the level that I'm fighting against. Not taking that into consideration when I absolutely should be. Not applying my buffs, not looking closely at what's around me. Most of my characters have died within the first 10 minutes of the stream. Uh, gotta settle in. So I saw somebody at the top of that hill there. Level 8, level 8. To be fairly... Fairly spread out, which is good. Missionary. He likes to go for those slow, deliberate hits, doesn't he? Peace Bloom over here. Let's pull her down here. Munch, munch, munch. Eating, eating that leg. Munch, munch, munch. Stop, stop, stop. Insignia rings. Is that earth for oh, silver leaf? Oh yeah, over here is the uh, the entrance, another entrance to Undercity. For would be invaders. But also the way the bats the bat handle uh, the bats that you ride, the mounts fly out that way too. Dark Hound. Don't want trouble. One more bar away. One small bar. Okay, that's all the zealots, so we need one more missionary, and we need Captain Perrine, which I bet she's over there. Is she over there? She is in there, somewhere. Oh, this is actually quite dangerous. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Quite dangerous. Let's reset this. One at a time. One at a time. Like if I was higher level, like I was level 10 or something, probably wouldn't worry as much, but... Thank you for that. 
Level 9, one more. Let's try that again. bit too close. Just a little bit too close. So I need to get Captain Perry and is she around here? She, he, sorry. <laughs> we got a, a zealot over here which is level 8. Um, and I don't have sap. So I can't take one out of the picture. But if I throw a dagger at this guy, can I get just him to come out? Come on, come on, come on. Please hit, please hit. Please hit. Thank you. I think we're good because we've got evasion. I've still got a, a healing potion. Nothing's around. So I'll take the potion. Backstab. Finish it off. Finish the fight. Eat a mushroom. <laughs> All things that need to be done. So it really doesn't matter when you... I mean, it matters still. If you're not playing hardcore, but it just, it's just amped up. When everything's riding on... You getting them down without them... Without them downing you. Okay, War with the Scarlet Crusade's done. Didn't get many of these insignia rings. Only two out of the whole lot. Bag seems to be okay. Picked up a bunch of mail. Silver leaf. Now, is there any reason for me to go over there other than just getting that ring? Doesn't look like it. But I can, I can potentially get the ring from this as well. I might just take this back then. And go on to another quest. And if we get the ring, we get the rings. Delivery to Silver... Oh, I'm not going to Silver Pine Forest. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not going there yet. Level 10, level 12. I don't know. Maybe. I mean, not now, but... I would like to be done completely with the zone. Maximize the amount of XP I get. A lot of Dark Hounds. Easy, easy. Everything's in the yellow, good. 
pretty risky going through those uh, trees there because you don't know what's behind it without constantly hitting the, the uh, tab button but you know you might miss something there run into three of these hounds or something pray that you can take him down or run away hello here to learn about that better be time is a luxury that is not here to learn about potions I've got plenty to teach weak blood weak trolls blood at level 15 Gonna make a couple more of these. Make some more of those. Gets us to level 10. Victory Fossil. Here to learn about Hello. Hello. Captain Perrine's death will undoubtedly please the Dark Lady. You have performed your duty well, adventurer. Executor would like me to go and slay. At war with a sky, I guess, over here, so another chance to get two quests done at the same time. What is it? Let's get rid of all that. Craft some linen bandages. Looks like we can cook some things up as well. Crispy bat wing will give us two stem and spirit. Beware the living. Just go back. Actually, we can do it over here. We'll cook these up. And then the bat wing gets us to level 20. Good. Rest your weary bones. Sell for cheese, sell that. Alright, so we got a little bit of buff food. Can train you in first aid technique. Heavy linen at 40. What am I at? 33. Embrace Getting close. Closer. With the sanction of Lord Ver. So slice and dice, we are at level 10. Sprint at level 10. Dual wield. And sap, so three silver each. Six. Nine. Nine and twelve. Our enemies All right. I just got to make sure so I don't uh, go out there and spend all my cash. Go, okay, oh look, there's an interesting uh, dagger. Twenty-five silver gone. All right, so... We will... Oh, actually, we could probably get this spell book. That seems very... It seems like it'd be easy to grab. This will probably be the one that does us in. It seems simple. Seems simple enough. Is that the way it's going to work out, though? Call it now. Make your call now. <laughs> Yay or nay? I don't know if there's anything in the water. Terror fish. Terror fish. Oh, no, that's a different game, isn't it?
threshers in here or something, or frenzy, frenzy fish. So we got a shamley horror. And we got a that's not what we don't need that anyway. Just keep moving. Just keep swimming. So it's interesting. We got a breath meter, but I don't think it's actually meant to be breath. It's just like your your skin is actually deteriorating when you go underwater. I believe it's a lot slower than other other races. There's Gunther. Who's level 53? Hopefully you don't have a problem with me taking this spell book. See one up there behind the tree. You need to take him out or not. There's the book. I really don't feel safe here. Eat a mushroom. Eat a mushroom quick. I'm listening. Okay, Gunther, you you be cool. Be cool, Gunther. Got it. Let's get out of here. It's interesting because there could be quests out there. <laughs> there could be quests out there that do actually kill you and they bring you back alive. I wonder if. I wonder if there is a quest like that. I feel like there might be. Funny, I, I remember titling the first episode of this, Death Equals Delete. Well, I'm already dead. <laughs> so, does that mean the hardcore challenge is already over? Ah, uh, Silver Leaf, Silver Leaf. That needs to be taken all the way back to Undercity. Alright, so we'll do that later. I'm not going to go all the way back there just for that. Approaching the halfway mark. Looking for the road again. So, yeah, this takes me to where the Murlocs are. There's this, but it says level 10. I'm thinking I'd go over here and try these out. What would you ask of death? 
Death Guard Kell. Where's this road go? Is there a roadblock ahead or? I mean, there's a hillside there. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. It's the grave robbers. So we're gonna go around it. Stop it. Don't be so suspicious. There's nothing here. It's just the wind. Silver spawn. Yep. So those lost souls again. So I've got to get. Oh, I'm not even there yet. I kind of just went around the long way and didn't go. I didn't go anywhere. Thought I was already over here. Oh. Close, close, close call. Ah, so I really got to get all the way up there, don't I? I go around, then up. A lot of bags around. A lot of bag icons. This place might be pretty thick. Or it just simply means that there's lots of spawn locations. Okay, so I see these guys, and I know that they can cast, and I'm pretty sure they hurt. So I probably should buff up. Take a potion or two. It's a pity I can't get that strength one going as well. Get into it. Oh, dodged. He's going to do it as soon as he comes out of it, isn't he? Yep. That's one skull. Devlin Agamond, level 9. Are you by yourself, Devlin? Bonecast is too close. That's actually not too bad. I thought he was going to hit me with something harder. I guess the worst part would be if he casts that. Frosts me down there, he starts running away. Although I might be able to just chip at him with my throw. Oh, 
Pull it up, pull it up, pull it up. Devlin coming back. I think we're clear. Hopefully it doesn't hit too hard. Here to visit the family? Die fool! Expert dodger. Parry. Devlin's remains. Beautiful. So we need notched ribs. Where do we get notched ribs from? A little bit further over. Fifty percent mark now. Not too bad, not too bad. Rib. This guy's only level six. Two notched rib. Come on, I need that blackened skull. Ah, oh, damn it. <laughs> Luring me back to the caster in the tree. I love to just do those sharp turns, don't they? A sharp 180. Cool, number two. Uh, these two are a bit close, but I'll I'll give it a go. Better start running. Best to start running. Yeah, looking at all these icons, you'd think that'd be <laughs> just everywhere, but I mean, they do roam around. There is quite the spread. Beautiful. That's all three of those. Now I just need these guys. Just need those ribs, mate. Prime rib.
one more. One final rib. Well, it's not just one rib. It's like a whole, a whole rack of ribs, right? Although you probably don't want to associate it with rack of ribs. What I'm getting from these guys. Fantastic, okay. So that's all done. Uh, but ah, uh, there are remains that need to be gathered. See, this is where we have issues, right? This is where we're going to run into problems. This is where it gets interesting. Everything was fine. So hang on a second, where are the... Where's the remains? I was there. It's not in the house, is it? I mean, looking at the mini-map, it looks like it's... At the back? Oh, I'm getting pretty close. It's probably... Unless there's a mound outside here somewhere. Uh, I guess it is inside. And of course, this is covered by several... Enemies. Can I do anything wonky? Like, is it just here? And I'm able to do one of these things? <laughs> and somehow click it. Sometimes. In some areas you can do things like that. I think I remember getting a book that way. I'm feeling like the risk is too high here. Like, I, hey, look at that. Look what I would have run straight into. Oh, there's Nissa. I would have run straight into her. I'm thinking I come back here when I'm a little bit higher. Just a tiny bit higher. Maybe I'll, I'll hearthstone back or hand these two quests in. Hope that it gets me closer to level 10. Because with level 10, I get a whole slew of new abilities. Which will help me do the job. Hopefully. Alright, let's do that. And then I'll do... I'll probably do this quest here. Maybe the Murloc quest. Quickly. Thank! Rest your weary bones. No one. The mills overrun. Gonna give me some. Gonna give me some decent XP for this one. Two, oh, two bars away. Two bars away. Actually, if we hand this one in, 525 XP. I mean, that'll get us close. I probably got to kill a few things on the outside before I go in there. But if I do that, then I go in there, I can level up, I'll be level 10, I'll be dual wielding. I have a few things. So I'll head towards the Undercity, and then we'll, we'll kill a few things on the way over there. <laughs> 